anniversary and maaasahan ng mga park goers ng Islam. So, mabuhay magical uh, day to everyone. Uh, we're really excited really to celebrate our 28 years Enchanted Kingdom. So, just to share with you, the theme actually is what's your enchanted story? Kasi gusto po namin marinig at makasama po kayo sa pag-celebrate ng aming anniversary sa Enchanted Kingdom. But there's so much in store um, actually for the whole month of October. It will be a year-long celebration. So, October pa lang simula. Um, so we will be bringing back actually our fireworks competition, the Sky Wizardry Fireworks Competition, which will be happening on October 7, 14, and 21. So every Saturday po yan. Ang grand finale kung saan ang ating top 3 na competitors ay maglalaban-laban sa October 28. Aside from the fireworks competition, we have World Teachers Day sa October 7 to celebrate our educators and teachers. October 14, nandiyan na po ang ating uh, grand uh, storybook characters parade. So everyone, especially the little ones, the kids, can uh, meet and greet our uh, characters na kasama po sa story na Enchanted Kingdom. And for October 21, in-invite naman namin ang social media influencers and content creators na kaibigan na Enchanted Kingdom to celebrate and we will have some performances, special performances from them. And lastly, um, sobrang dami kasi, October 28, uh, Be Enchanted Concert, kung saan uh, highlighted ang concert by Ms. KZ Tanding. So that is something to look forward to for the whole month of October. Sir, for the Sky Wizard Bee Fireworks Competition, ilang years bago na bumalik ulit itong kilalang fireworks competition? So that's a very good question. Uh, alam naman po natin na ito po yung gustong gusto na ating mga guests. Um, ito po yung tinanong namin sa isang survey kung ano po ang gusto nilang makita sa anniversary at ang fireworks competition na una nilang kinakaroon. So it has been 8 years. Uh, since we actually had the, the last spectacle, so gusto po talaga namin ibalik ito uh, to really bring excitement, magic, and enchantment. At ito po ang uh, giving uh, what our guests uh, want. So ito po ay celebrate talaga natin and you'll get to see that for the whole month of October every Saturday. So may how many competitors ang magpapasiklat kung mga survivors competition? International ba yung mga or local lang? Yeah, so for now, I think we had uh, both local and international before in the previous years. But for this year, we want to highlight the Filipino creativity. So we will be focusing on um, six competitors. So every Saturday, po, magalaban laban po ang dalawa, kung saan ang top three every Saturday ay magalaban laban po sa ating grand finale ng Sky Wizardry Fireworks Competition. So excited po kami dahil ito po ay promotion nila creativity na Filipino. At napabalik po natin ang isang napaka exciting para sa ating mga loyal. Okay, sir, later para magkakaroon na, ibabalik na yung Moonlight Parade. Sir, uh, parang baga ito na yung simula ng mga parang Pasco feels sa evening, sir. So, uh, at this, uh, this moment, syempre, October lang pinapag-usapan namin, but we have so much in store, especially for the month of November, um, even the Christmas tree lighting na mangyayari sa December. So, marami po tayo mangyayari, and this Moonlight Parade, actually, is the start of leading up to the fireworks. So, this is a, an opportunity for everyone to meet our dancers, our circle of artists, but also some of our storybook characters. So, ito Moonlight Parade ito ay talagang appetizer lang po, uh, compared sa ano mangyayari sa October 4th dito saan magkakaroon tayo ng Grand Parade before the fireworks. So, ano po yung mga asap ko? Yung Paskong dadating po, ano po yung mga aasapan sa mga kababayan natin dito sa Enchanted So, um, as mentioned, so after October, maraya po tayo events na mangyayari. Um, magkakaroon kami ng Halloween activities, sa December ang ating Christmas tree lighting, at maraya po kami mga events na pinaplano. But one thing that we're very excited to share is we will be launching our new retail and dining um, experience and uh, uh, venue. So yan po ay mag-open sa December kung saan meron kaming dalawang or tatlo na branded restaurants uh, that will provide more magical experiences for us. So aside from the theme park, aside from the rides, attractions, what you can experience here in Chattel Kingdom, we will be also launching this retail dining and entertainment venue um, in December. So maraming po tayong exciting na uh, magagandang up, lalo na po leading up to Christmas because we know Enchanted Kingdom is very popular for Christmas events. Sir Nico, sorry, kung nang pag-uwi na si EK after the three years ng pandemic? So, um, good question. So, masasabi ko na yes, nakabawi na kami dahil sa support na ng mga tao. Uh, dahil we're able to really see that the school groups are back, the corporate groups are back, um, our loyal guests are back because we're able to really provide them uh, an experience that is magical, fun, and safe. So, we are excited 
excited and of course, uh, in terms of our park guests and park attendants, kumabalik na po talaga. Even better than an average. Right now, siguro we can say around 10 to 15,000 uh, on a very good day. Pero uh, yan po ay talaga ba experience natin lang na talaga sa October, November, December. So, thank you po sa mga sumusuporta at talaga buwi bisita sa Enchanted Kingdom because uh, it is really a milestone for us and that is why we're also celebrating you as part of the anniversary. Thank Sir, last na po. Uh, may sneak peek po kayo na sinabi na magkakaroon ng bagong attraction next year. Yes. Pwede lang po malama ano po yung tema nun? Ah, very good question. So at, at this point, actually, medyo bago pa lang yan. But it's something that will be family friendly. Mm -hmm. uh, something that will be uh, available and uh, for kids and for families. Uh, very colorful siya. And hopefully that uh, we will be able to launch it towards the end of the year. So something that can, people can be really excited about because we always want to deliver new rides and attractions and experiences here in Enchanted Kingdom. Sorry, December 17, is that not too late for the day operations? So actually we launched December 17 um, mainly because we also have the school holidays uh, to make sure that we're able to accommodate and capture all of our guests as much as possible. Now, December 17 is just a day, pero syempre, gusto namin kasi pag nagplano kami ng day, we're able to prepare really more experiences that are unique and different for the Filipino people. But in the, if, if the demand is there, of course, we are able to evaluate because we we'll always listen to what uh, the Filipino people want and make sure that we provide those magical experiences. So, pwedeng magagahan tayo? Sana magagahan, pero ngayon at this point, uh, ang mapapromise natin is December 17. Okay. And hopefully by then, lahat po na gusto namin enhancements and for, for the guests ay ma-prepare at mahanda. So, stay tuned na lang and maybe we'll be announcing a different date um, in the coming weeks. Okay. Sir, last question. Uh, last year anniversary, uh, natanong ko to with uh, to Mrs. Mamo, yung regarding sa educational tour. Yes. We all know na it's about uh, rate talaga ng percentage of at uh, park attendees is uh, the students. So this year, nakapag ano mas dumami pa yung percent ng nag uh, educational tour. So that's a uh, well, it's very important that um, you know Enchanted Kingdom as a an educational institution, we actually have collaborations with all schools, universities, um, other institutions, and even with the Department of Education. Because uh, not just um, as a theme park, but we really want to make sure that we provide entertainment, which is education and entertainment at the same time. So at, at this point, actually, I would say the second quarter, we were really filled with field trips. So we were happy to give them education and uh, or magic to our students. Because we know that in 28 years, we are all students and we are part of the Enchanted Kingdom as part of our field trip and other experiences. So, so far, um, we all know that they will be coming back again uh, in the coming months. But we're really uh, you know, uh, appreciative and excited that the field trips are back because they are a big chunk of what Enchanted Kingdom is all about. And that is education and really providing magic experiences to all the people. Thank you, Paul.